Hey guys, Thunder E here and welcome to our gaming first look at the Oppo Find X2 Pro. Want to give a big shout out to Oppo for sponsoring this video and also sending over the Find X2 Pro for us to check out. So let's jump in. So if you don't know Oppo and the Find X series, which came out two years ago, that was the first device that had a all bezel-less display, slide out camera, was great. But the Find X2 Pro takes things to the very next level. It's 6.7 inch display, it's an OLED display that packs in a lot of great features. It is gorgeous. Whether you're watching video or you're just looking at content or you're gaming as we're gonna be doing here, it looks really, really good. Now this display is a QHD Plus display and of course it's also a 120 hertz display. Yes, you heard that right, QHD Plus 120 hertz. That's amazing. So what does that mean for us while we game? It means we can game not only at 60 Hertz, we can also game at 120 Hertz, but not just at 1080p, but at QHD+. So which means you can take things as max as possible and enjoy the amount of gaming that you want. So that is truly amazing. Now, uh, besides the gorgeous display and watching content on it, I might add, looks really, really good. Spec-wise, we've got the Snapdragon 865 processor, which means this is a 5G device and it's 5G capable. You can take advantage of 5G speeds wherever you are. You can also have the uh, confidence that this has 12 gigs of RAM as well built into the device and it's running UFS storage uh, 3.0 and our device here has 512 gigabytes of storage. So there is a lot for you gaming fans in there to say, okay, look, I've got performance, I've got all the things in there, what can I do gaming-wise? Well, first of all, you can pin your application so you can go ahead and quickly access them whenever you want to. In our case, of course, it's gonna be games. And the games we'll be checking out are, of course, PUBG Mobile, Call of Duty Mobile, as well as Fortnite in our gaming first look. Now, I can't wait to show you guys the display in action. 120 hertz with a QHD Plus display is absolutely amazing on a device like this. I've gotta tell you though that a 240 hertz touch sampling really feels good, but wait to see it for yourself when we check out some gaming with PUBG Mobile, Call of Duty Mobile, Fortnite, and a few streaming services, and we'll check out some temperatures. So, let's jump in.
And as you saw, the games ran excellently and really well. The 120 Hz plus display, 240 Hz plus sampling is truly unbelievable. It feels smooth, the games look vibrant, and playing Call of Duty Mobile on there, I mean, for me, is just, it's golden, right? Uh, I can't ask for anything better. Coupled with, of course, the processor and RAM, uh, this is truly something that you guys have to definitely check out. Now, when it comes to uh, games supporting 120 hertz, not everyone supports it yet because, of course, they have to be updated. So once that comes through, you're going to see more and more games that you would like. Take advantage of this display and the performance that you have right here. Now, in terms of temperatures, though, I was quite impressed to see 87 degrees with all the gaming I did on this device. So I have to say, though, I like what they're doing with the Find X2 Pro. Now, you're thinking, okay, it sounded really good. What about audio? Well, it's got Dolby Atmos in there and you've got a couple of Dolby Atmos settings, but let's take a listen to how well this actually sounds. So that was pretty good, right? 103.9 decibels, great audio, a lot of performance there, but this device still packs in a lot more features and you're going, okay, Thunder E, we did all that gaming, we listened to audio, how about the battery? So you've got two batteries that come up to 4,600 milliamps. It's not as big as you might think, but it is paired with the Supervoke 65 watt charger. So what that means is that according to Oppo, it says you can charge this device from zero to 100 in 40 minutes. Well tell you they were wrong. I actually clocked it at 38 minutes. Now, this is truly impressive. It means that in 15 minutes, you can get 50, 57% uh, charge in this device. So no matter how long and how much you game, like that, boom, you're back in action. So I think that's truly impressive and something to see, especially with a device like this. Now, Oppo also has a new camera array system, a 48 megapixel main sensor, 48 megapixel ultra wide, 10X hybrid zoom. And I have to say though, it's really solid from what I've seen so far. I mean, uh, photos in daytime look crisp. Uh, the zoom lens looks pretty nice at 5X. Uh, and then your nighttime photos also come out pretty well too. Solid nighttime photography that actually had me shocked. Uh, so I can't wait to test it out more. Now, this also has the ultra steady mode, which means you can do action videos for photography uh, with this at 1080p 60 frames per second. There's a lot in here in this device that uh, makes me quite excited to spend some more time with. Uh, the display at 120 Hertz, QHD+, uh, all that gaming performance, uh, seeing what it can do, the cameras, uh, all that fun stuff, and the super fast charging. I can't wait to just test it out. So if you guys want to see a full review of the Oppo uh, Find X2 Pro, let me know. So if you guys wanna see a full review of the Oppo Find X2 Pro, Leave your thoughts down below. Also guys, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and tell me what games you wanna see on our full gamer review. This is Thunder E saying thank you, and always enjoy your entertainment.